Making my way downtown, dark and brown. Do you want to play 2K? What? Do you want to play 2K? You're gay? Huh? You're gay? Yes. Yes, I want to play. Yes. Wait, how long have you been gay? Huh? How long have you been gay? How long do I want to play? That's a weird question. Uh, three hours. Four years? Bro, I, I, I've always knew. I've always knew. Huh? I've always knew. What I, team am I going to use? Uh, The Rockets. The Rockets. I'll use the Rockets. What? The Rockets. Wait, what? The Rockets. Topless? You want to see me topless? Huh? You want to see me topless? Yes. I uh, yes. I uh, yes. Why? I, I don't. They're a good team. They're all around players. It's all around good team. You want to be all around me? Yes. All right, look. So I have two hundred dollars. Right, I'm gonna put it in this bowl and turn it upside down. If you can get the money without touching the bowl, then I'll let you keep it. All right. Okay. And you can't slide the ball either. I forgot to say that. You can't slide it. You can't slide the ball. You cannot touch the ball. Really? Yeah, that's too easy. Anyone would have thought of that. Do you want the easy way or the hard way? I don't want either way. I'm trying to win. The hard way. All right, look, if you can get one of these $20 bills from under this water bottle without making the water bottle fall or touching the water bottle, then I'll let you have all this money, all right? But if you touch it or it knocks down, you got to give me $100, so you better got $100 on you or something. Hey, you, did you not hear me in the beginning? I said you can't roll the dollar bill up. You didn't say that. I did say that. I said it in the beginning, we're winding the video. That's, anyone would have thought of that. Just roll the dollar bill up. I'm not that. Wait, I said they said you can't bang the table either. You didn't. You didn't say that. Well, I was about to say it. I forgot to say it in the beginning. That's too easy. You can't bang the table. You can't touch the water bottle. Can't make the water bottle fall. You can't roll the dollar bill up. And if it falls, you got to pay me. And plus, I forgot to put all the money underneath, anyways. Like this, it's hard, better like that, more challenging. All right, so. Get out, get out, get out! I don't want to bet you anymore. Precious, come here. Come here, I got a bet for you. If you can get the money from under the water bottle without making the water bottle fall or touching the water bottle, then you get to have the money. I already know what you did. You put glue at the top of the bottle. You just see me put it down. I didn't put glue. Or I have, do I look like I got glue on me? Look, I don't have water. What do you mean? So a week ago, I froze my sister's glasses in Jolly Ranchers because I thought she was the one that froze my key. But I found out it was actually Black Squidward. So I've been trying to think of how to get her back in. I got it. So I went in her room to steal her bonnet. Look, this might be the reason she's always mad. This thing always on her head. So look, I got a small balloon, a medium balloon, and a big balloon. We're going to go ahead and uh, stuff it in the small balloon. Stop playing. Going to fill it up and draw a face on the small balloon real quick. Stop playing. Look at me. An artist going to stuff this in the medium balloon. Look at it looking like I'm about to go rob a bank. Stop playing. Got the blue Kool-Aid. 
pour it up real quick fill some water and then we're gonna draw a face on this one as well do you guys know where this is from now i could not stuff this in the big balloon so i had to get my third sister to help look dreamwork makes the teamwork or something like that there was still some room in the balloon so i went to go take my sister's shoes these are the shoes we made a long time ago doing an art competition that i lost by the way you guys never vote for me stuff those in there put some cranberry juice to stain the shoes ain't no going back now gonna draw a face on the big balloon and let it freeze overnight in the deep freezer tune into part two to see a reaction Surprise! Happy birthday! <laughs> what kind of cake is that? It's a cheesecake. It's your favorite, right? That's not a cheesecake. Cheesecake. Just blow the candles out. They're not even lit up. So pretend like they're lit. It's because we had a bug. I was trying to get out for like. I got you a gift. Happy birthday. Hope you like it. Some black Air Forces, right? Your favorite? That's what you... These aren't black Air Forces. Those are black Air Forces. They cost me like $120 a gift. The tag is still on there and it says it's $27. Oh, that's a coupon. $27 off. Next purchase. Why is the Nike up two E's? There's a Spanish bird. I bought them from Spanish Nike. So it's Nike. Uh... Go. Black Squidward. Ooh, okay, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Two, three, go. Okay, two more, two more, two more, two more, two more. Oh, ooh. oh. All right, you got nine seconds. Three, Black Luigi. Two, one. Sandy Cheeks. Ooh, okay, she's starting out. Whoa, my God, she's starting out fast. Oh. oh. <laughs> At eight minutes and eight seconds. It was eight minutes and eight that, seconds. That, oh, my, uh, oh, my God. Sandy uh, Cheeks wins. Sandy Cheeks wins. What's your favorite food? What's my favorite fuel? What's your favorite food? Okay, I, I'll probably say like propane. Propane. Wait, you know, like favorite? King of the Hill. What's your favorite food? Propane. What's my favorite pool? I mean, that's kind of... Uh, probably like what? A cholo or essay? Pool? Favorite yeah, pool. food. Pool? What is... A clown? Cholo. Um, gasoline. What's your mom's nickname? Huh? What's your mom's nickname? Baby Back Ribs. Sweet and low. What's your mom's nickname? Oh, oh, okay. Whey protein powder. COVID-19. What's your favorite color? Huh? What? What's your favorite color? Um. Uh, so, one of my dirtiest secrets is after I use the bathroom, I don't wash my hands. Wait, say what was the question again? What is your favorite color? Uh, my favorite community is, uh, Community College. Yeah, I like that community a lot. What's your dog's name? What? Say it one more time. What is your dog's name? Oh, uh, my favorite dookie is the one when you, like, you, it drops in the toilet real fast and it splashes your butt cheek with water. What is your dog's name? You're saying, do we eat brain? Listen, do I look like Jeffrey? Because I don't do those things, okay? All right? No. No, oh, that's dirty. You said your favorite dookie is the one that hangs in your butt and you got to suck it back up? Yeah, because... I don't eat no brains. That's weird. That's, that's nasty, bro. That's weird. All right, look, you can get this cross to go out of this bottle without touching the cross at all. Or using anything to touch it, I'll give you fifty dollars, right? So you cannot touch the toothpick, cannot touch the straw, can't touch the cross at all, all right? So go ahead. <laughs> you notice that doesn't work, right? You know why that doesn't work? 
because the chemicals in the air mix when you're blowing it. E equals mc squared, Newton's theory doesn't let you. The air pressure from the top molecules and the protons and the electrons do not let it blow out. So when you're blowing up, the inwards motion of the air is causing the, the atoms and to just combine and compress in the bottle. So it's not really working. So you, which you like... <laughs> Like I said, to the second power, there's no way that this is possible because the air is thicker than the, the volume. Whoever makes the egg fall gets it cracked on their head. Oh, 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 oh. oh, oh, oh. oh you went right in the middle. Oh, he took it. He said, I'm not going to get the game. Okay. Dang. She lost. All right, so look, I got these two matches, all right? I'm gonna balance it on this glass. If you can knock down these two matches without touching the match, touching the cup, banging on anything, or blowing on the matches, I'll give you $100, all right? Okay. All right, go ahead. Wait, let me see those real quick. There's like a stick. Oh! Why'd you my, do that? My, 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 my hand slid. Go, what do you mean? What are you doing? You don't even need your glasses. I'm Just do it. I'm grabbing a glass. I'm grabbing a glass. I'm not thirsty. All right, if you can get this ball to go in this glass, then I'll give you $100, all right? But here's the catch. I'm going to turn the cup upside down. So you got to figure out a way to get this ball in this glass while keeping this glass upside down, all right? <laughs> okay, that's what I like to see. You. But, and you can't, the, I was about to say you can't touch this glass. You didn't say that. You didn't let me, you didn't even give me a chance to finish. That's, anyone could have thought of that, of course, scrape it. Come on now. So you gotta figure out a different way. This glass can't move, and this has to stay upside down. So like, you gotta think it's... That's not how fizzy, that's not gonna get a... Playing the quiet place game. <laughs> Somebody wants to. I'm gonna leave my stack of money right here. Do not touch it. I'm gonna just go use the bathroom real quick, all right? Don't touch it. I'll be right back. He just said don't touch it. It's not like he counted it. Well then, I'm gonna take some. Dude, you took too much. I didn't. He's gonna notice. Come on, let's go. 
All right, if you can get the quarter from underneath the mats without making the matches fall, I'll give you $20, all right? But if you make any one of the matches fall, then you got to give me $20, all right? Do you want it sure. the easy way or the hard way? The easy way. This is going to be fun. I meant the easy way for me. Remember, I said you can't use another match and you can't use a lighter, so I don't know what you're... I have some water. Okay. And I have some salt. Some salt? Okay. If you could drink the salt water without removing the towel, I'll give you $50. And if you can't, you have to give me $50. So all I have to do is drink that salt water without touching the towel? I bet. Hold on. <laughs> Lucky for you, I got this Bluetooth straw. <laughs> Done. Really? Check. Check for yourself. You said without touching the towel, right? <laughs> <laughs> so I can just drink the drink now. If you can get this quarter out of this bowl without getting your hands wet, then I'll give you a hundred dollars, all right? But if you can't do it, then you gotta give me a hundred dollars, all right? Okay. You can you have to get the quarter out of the water, you cannot get your hands wet. All right? You can't spill no water either. Okay. And you can't use your glasses on top of that. Alright? Mm-hmm. I bet. What is that? Salt. Wait, well, where's your glasses at? The cord is not wet no more. Chocolate soap prank. So we're going to cover the soap in some chocolate and leave it in the freezer until someone grabs it. Let's get it. Where'd you get that? The freezer? That's mine. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Give it to me. Oh, that's yours. The other side. I'm, I'm allergic to vanilla. Mm. What is that? There's a there's a there's a spot. Looks like a cinnamon roll could kill you. Looks like they could kill you is a cinnamon roll. Looks like a cinnamon roll is a cinnamon roll. Looks like could kill you would kill you. Ellie straw challenge. Let's get it. Ooh, look at it looking slimy. You not ready? Set, go.
all you have to do is get the money from under the coins without making the coins fall. You can't grab the... You didn't even let me finish talking. You should get the orange soda. It's amazing. Okay. What would you ladies like to drink? Orange soda, please. I'll have the strawberry soda. Me too. Strawberry soda. I am so shocked. I made you breakfast. You did? What is it? Woo! What is that? An egg. From what? A crow? <laughs> I mean, go ahead, Paradise. You said you were hungry. I don't even like breakfast. Eat it. I mean, I only like my eggs with like cheese on them, you know, like the fancy. Bon appetit. Mm. My name's Precious, and I brought the potato salad. All right, my name's Paris, aka Black Luigi, and I brought the cornbread. Yes, sir. My name's Jasmine, and I brought the sweet potato pie. And Mark, get set, go! <laughs> I didn't do that on purpose. I mean, accident. Are you laughing or crying? It's funny, right, guys? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> um, ah! Ooh. Yes! Bro, why would you do that? Okay. Oh! Oh! Ooh! Ooh! <laughs> Seeing who knows me the best. My favorite basketball team is the Los Angeles Lakers. Um, Lakers. What's the city the Lakers are from? LA. Hey! The Nuggets, because your head looks like a nugget. Hey, how do you know? No, get out. My birthday is September 3rd. Like, September 3rd? Hey! Girl, you guessed. You guessed you didn't know my birthday. <laughs> February 31st. February only got 28 days. My favorite fruit is a pineapple or a mango. Um, I'm gonna guess and say like watermelon. You think I'm black and my favorite fruit is a watermelon? No, get out. Strawberry. Neck cracking prank on my sister. Let's get it! My neck was, uh, I just think it like, bro. Did he just pass out? I don't know, check his pulse. I didn't feel That's mine. Good. No, it's. We have to get him help. What's the number to 911? What's the number to the number to nine one one is nine one one? What are you talking about? I thought your neck was broke.
didn't care for it. I have this Sharpie cap and I have these coins. Okay. If you can knock down the coins without touching the cup or using anything to touch the cup, I'll give you $20. Okay, bet. That's easy. Wait, you said knock down the coins without touching the cup? How are you supposed to do that? How are you supposed to do that? I don't know how to do that. Go like this? No, I'm not helping you. You have dirt on your shoulder. Where? Now stick your finger out. Really? Excuse me, do you want to take this $20 or do you want to double it and give it to the next person? Double it and give it to the next person. Okay, she's nice, bet. Excuse me, do you want to take this $40 or do you want to double it and give it to the next person? Double it and give it to the next person. Okay, you're nice too. Excuse me, would you rather take this $80 or double it and give it to the next person? Double it and give it to the next person. Okay, okay. Excuse me, ma'am. Yo, what's up? I mean, sir, would you rather take $160 or would you rather double it and give it to the next person? I'll take the 160. You sure? You don't want to double it and give it to the next person? I want to take the 160. Oh, okay then. All right, look, you can get this cross to go out of this bottle without touching the cross at all or using anything to touch it. I'll give you $50, all right? So you cannot touch the toothpick, cannot touch the straw, can't touch the cross at all. All right? So go ahead. You notice that doesn't work, right? You know why that doesn't work? Because <laughs> the chemicals in the air mix when you're blowing it, E equals MC squared, Newton's theory doesn't let you. The air pressure from the top molecules and the protons and the electrons do not let it blow out. So when you're blowing up, the inwards motion of the air is causing the, the atoms and to just combine and compress in the bottle. So it's not really working. So you, which you like, <laughs> Like I said, to the second power, there's no way that this is possible because the air is thicker than the, the volume. Playing the quiet place game. Sandy Cheeks, do you think you got a napkin I can use, please? Yeah. Okay, thanks. Huh. I got it. Squidward, what are you doing? Bro. He's, he's camping. Don't mind. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Playing the quiet place game. If you can get this candle to go out without blowing on the candle or pouring any liquid on the candle, then I'll give you ten whole dollars, all right? Ten dollars? Yeah, girl, don't get paid till next week. Come on. But you only get one try. You know, I could just cut off the oxygen. 
What do you mean cut off the arm? Okay, but I, I said nothing can touch the candle. You didn't say that? I said that at the beginning of the video. Why? I said nothing can touch the candle. Okay, I'll give you one more try since you didn't hear me, obviously. I said nothing can touch the candle. So you got to blow the candle out without blowing on the candle. And no liquid can touch the candle. And nothing can touch the candle. So you, you cutting off the oxygen, that's not going to work. <laughs> the airbender. Sandy Cheeks. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Dang, okay, you got what? 300. You got 300? Okay. And Black Squidward. Nine, eight, seven, six, five. I was, I was, um, uh, it's because it's like you had two on your plane and two drops, so like I was trying to like put them. So, um, one, two, three. Ten, nine, eight, seven, Bro, six, five, four. Mm-hmm. I know I got like $300 bills on that one. one. <laughs> Really? If you can pick up this bottle using your palm, then I'll give you 15 whole dollars, all right? <laughs> so you gotta use your palm. You cannot use your fingers to just lift it up. You gotta use your palm, all right? <laughs> you know why you can't do it, right? <laughs> it's because the diameter of your hand and the diameter of the bottle are two different radiuses. So when you try to palm it. You know, I could it, just use glue, right? No, I literally said in the beginning you can't use glue. You, you I didn't said you can't use your fingers, you, you can't use that. glue, you can't use, you glue, can't use, you can't use tape. I'm saying you gotta just lift it like a basketball. Girl, you don't use glue, you can't use glue. So you gotta like do something else. Like I said, the radius of the bottle and the radius of your hand doesn't equivalent because the pi and the bottle, basically if you think of it in a mathematical formula, it's like a hundred times, a hundred is a thousand. But if you add the to the second power, then it's If you can get this dollar out of these two glasses without separating the glasses, then I'll give you 10 whole dollars, right? <laughs> Am I allowed to get the counters wet? I mean, you can get them a little wet, but this glass has to stay face down. This glass has to stay face up and you can't like break them up, like just take it apart. So like it needs to stay like this, but the dollar needs to come out. Do you want it the easy way or the hard way? The easy way. I want the, the, the easy way for me to win. I mean, I was thinking like you can probably like drill a hole on the top and like maybe get a straw and like start sucking all the water out or something, but that's kind of... What are you doing? 
All right, if you can get this candle to go out without blowing on the candle or pouring any liquid on the candle, then I'll give you ten whole dollars. All right. Ten dollars. Yeah, girl, don't get paid till next week. Come on. But you only get one try. You know, I could just cut off the oxygen. What do you mean cut off the oxygen? Okay, but I, I said nothing can touch the candle. You didn't say that? I said that at the beginning of the video. Why? I said nothing can touch the candle. Okay, I'll give you one more try since you didn't hear me, obviously. I said nothing can touch the candle. So then you got to blow the candle out without blowing on the candle. And no liquid can touch the candle. And nothing can touch the candle. So you, you cutting off the oxygen, that's not going to work. <laughs> the airbender. If you can get this blue cap to go in between these two orange caps, then I'll give you fifty dollars, right? But here's the rules: this cap you can touch and move wherever. This middle cap you can touch it, but it cannot move from the middle and where it's at. It has to stay right here, right? This third cap you cannot touch it, but it can move, all right? And that's all the rules. So I could touch this one, but it can't move. Mm -hmm. I can't touch this one, but it can move. Exactly. And this one could go wherever. Yep, and you got to get this blue one in between these two orange ones. Okay. All right, go ahead. Wait a minute, I was in the... I was in the... I said that you can't blow the cat. You didn't even let me get to it. You didn't say that. I'll just do it one more time. You can keep the money. I'm not even going to cheat you. I'm not going to do that. But what I meant to say is you cannot blow on any of the caps. You cannot use anything to move the caps. You got to get this blue one in between the two orange ones. And you get 50 more dollars. All right? And you cannot blow on anything. All right? You remember the rules? This one, you can touch this one. It can't move. You cannot touch this one. And okay. it can move. All right? All right, if you can get the quarter from off of the plate without getting your hands wet or touching the plate, then I'll give you $20, all right? What happens to all the $100 bets? Girl, you want to bet or not? Yeah. I could just dry it with napkins. No, I said in the beginning you can't use napkins. You didn't say that? I, wanted, I literally said it in the beginning. Don't, anyone would have thought of that. Just putting that. Then I don't know how to do it. You don't know? I'm just kidding. Remember, I said you can't get any milk on your hands. You can't get, get your hands wet. And you have to be the one to do it. All right, if you could put the quarter under the milk without getting the quarter wet, I'll give you a dollar, all right? No. You mean no? I want to do a hundred dollar bet. Where'd you get a hundred dollars from? You. Okay. Bro, no one's scared of a hundred dollar bet. You just really want to lose that bet? <laughs> all right, so go ahead. 
You cannot put the quarter in a bag and just try to put it in there. So like, it's under the milk. Girl, I said in the milk. No, you didn't. I literally said, girl, anyone? Hey, come on now. I'm saying, go put it in the milk, not under. That's under the cup. First of, first of all, so like, girl. Remember, I said you cannot put the quarter in a bag. And like try to like put it in there. You gotta put it in there for like at least like five seconds, like not a little, little, little dip. It's wet for sure. Kind of Spanish. Seven at the Say. I need some eye protection. I'm gonna go blind. What the? Uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> Tell me <no! laughs> like, Whoa, wait, wait. Did you just hear that? Bro, did what's you just hear that? No, wait. Shh, shh. Wait. Go! Come on, let it go. What you running for? <laughs> Hey, it's cracking! Whoa, whoa, whoa. I literally felt this man's heart when I just did this. Like, I'm. Um, oh, no! Wait, wait! Feel it! I'm, I'm not even joking! I can feel it! Ah! <laughs> hey, it's rolling towards it! Hey! If you can get any one of these paper clips to balance on the top of the water without making it sink, then I give you $100, all right? But if you can't, then you gotta give me $100. You only get three tries, all right? One, two, three, so don't try nothing fishy. <laughs> all right, so that's a, that's a 10 number one. Girl, are you nervous? You dropping the paper clip? <laughs> <laughs> that's one, you got two more tries. You're about to do a salt. Freeze it. Wait! Whoa, 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 whoa. How are you gonna freeze it with. It don't even matter. I said in the beginning of the video, I said, you have to bounce on the water, not ice. Ice is water. Okay, but ice is water with more electrons than I. I said in the beginning to use water. If I wanted to use ice, I would have just froze it. Started with a block of ice. So it's been two days since I broke my sister's glasses. Like, I've been stressing. Like, this literally started as a prank. All I did was take her glasses, get some melted gummy bears, and freeze them overnight in a container. And she really snitched on me? Like, what? Mom, Paris said my glasses are in the school. Get in my jar. You get not be broke. Like, why she got to get my mom involved? But I never would have guessed they would be broken in there. But you know what? Honesty is the best policy. Let me go tell her. And <gasps> is she asleep? Wait, you know what? Maybe I'll just wait and tell her tomorrow. Come here. Did you get her glasses? I have them on the counter. Go get them. Bring them here. Hurry up! You want to see them? Yeah, bring them here. Oh, oh, oh my god, are you okay? <gasps> what the? Man, I gotta go to the hospital. My neck and my Not back. Not you, my glasses. Let me see the glasses. I think I just like slipped on an ant. It was probably just got off the pool or something. It was like sweat or I, just, I didn't just did it on accident. Are they broke? Purpose. It was the ant's fault. It was they like, broke? You just need to get a little super glue. You got one week to get her some new glasses, Paris. One week. Seven days. 
Now you just get uh, uh, 11 days or uno uno in Spanish? No, siete, seven days. All right, if you can get the quarter from off of the plate without getting your hands wet or touching the plate, then I'll give you $20, all right? What happens to all the $100 bets? Girl, do you want to bet or not? Yeah. I could just dry it with napkins. No, I said in the beginning you can't use napkins. You didn't say that? I, wanna be, I literally said it in the beginning. Don't, anyone would have thought of that. Just putting that. Then I don't know how to do it. You don't know? I'm just kidding. Remember, I said you can't get any milk on your hands. You can't get, get your hands wet, and you have to be the one to do it. If you can pick up this bottle using your palm, then I'll give you 15 whole dollars, all right? <laughs> so you gotta use your palm. You cannot use your fingers to just lift it up. You gotta use your palm, all right? <laughs> you don't play basketball, huh? You can't pump a basketball? <laughs> you know why you can't do it, right? <laughs> it's because the diameter of your hand and the diameter of the bottle are two different radiuses. So when you try to pop, you know, I could just use glue, right? No, I literally said in the beginning you can't use glue. You, you I didn't said say you can't that. use your fingers, you, you can't use glue, you can't use tape. I'm saying you gotta just lift it like a basketball. Girl, you don't use glue, you can't use glue. So you gotta like do something else. Like I said, the radius of the bottle and the radius of your hand doesn't equivalent because the pie and the bottle basically, if you think of it in a mathematical formula, it's like a hundred times. A hundred is a thousand. But if you add the to the second power, then it's If you can knock this coin down, right, without banging on the table, blowing on anything, or using any balloons, then I'll give you twenty dollars, right? So go ahead. Remember, like I said, you cannot bang on the table, and you can't try to like blow or use anything to like blow air toward. Oh, you thought static electricity was going to work, huh? <laughs> you know why I set this up on purpose, right? Because a coin and a Sharpie cap, they have the same amount of protons, neutrons, and electrons in the chemistry, in the biology, in the, the astrology, make them perfect fit. So, like, it's not, static electricity is unaffected. It doesn't work like that. You know, like, 
in Pokemon, like a rock Pokemon, if you use static electricity, it... So I've been trying to think of a way to get my sisters back in. I got an idea, so I went in their room, and look at the way Sandy Booty Cheeks fell asleep. Are you serious? Girl, I should take that money right out your hand. But look, I found this chain in my sister's room. It has a P on it, so I'm pretty sure this is Black Squidward's chain. So I'm going to go ahead and try this experiment that I've been wanting to try for a while now. Look, going to put it in a plastic bag to keep it safe so she don't get too mad. I got this incredible Hulk toy. This is my sister's favorite superhero. We're going to do some open heart surgery and cut this man open. I got my degree from Squidward University, so nothing is going to go wrong. Oh, my God, it's Hulk! Came out. Hey, I need some help. Hey, move. Why are you moving so slow? I don't pay you six cents an hour to move that slow. Come on. But not to worry, guys. I am literally an expert at this. They do not call me Dr. Pepper for no reason. Look, we're going to go ahead and get the protons and the neutrons and the blood transfusion. And Okay, guys, look. I don't know what I'm doing. They did not teach us this at the Squidward University course. All they did was teach us how to cook Krabby Patties and play the clarinet. Like, but look. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, we just saved this man's life. Look, he good. So we're going to go ahead and fill it up with some water and put it in the deep freezer to freeze. Turn into part two to see a reaction. If you can blow up this balloon without putting your mouth on it, without blowing on it, without using no air pumps, no machinery, filling it up with water or anything like that, then I'll give you $100, all right? You're betting hundreds now? Yeah, girl, if I bet more, I'm going to win more. Because if you can't do it, you got to give me $100, all right? All right, <laughs> so go ahead. Remember, I said you cannot blow on it. And you cannot fill it up with water. Say. doing too much you know that there's no way you're gonna blow the balloon up unless you're worried you think you're the avatar is gonna air fire Ooh. It's not working. It's not? <laughs> Just kidding. Alright, so I have yellow water right here and blue water. If you can get them to mix, and make green water, I'll give you $40, all right? But here's the catch. These, this cup and the bottle, they cannot move. They need to stay right here. And you cannot blow on the top at all of this. No water can come out of the top. But they need to mix and make green, all right? And they can't move from here, all right? Okay. All right, go ahead. And you can't use nothing to, like, scoop the water out either. I, I just remembered about that, too. And you, you can't, you definitely can't do that either. You didn't say that. I just said no water can come out from the top. I actually did say that this time. I said no water, that's what I meant. Like, no water can come from the top. Girl, I'm not, I'm not gonna cheat you now. Wait. If you can get this bottle to hang off this toothpick, off this ledge like this, 
then I give you $20, right? But here's the catch. You cannot glue the toothpick to the counter like that, and you cannot empty any of the juice out of the bottle. It needs to stay exactly as heavy as it is, all right? Am so I allowed to use other toothpicks? Sure, other toothpicks, yeah. Okay. So how's that gonna help? All right. Remember, I said you cannot use any glue, cannot glue the toothpick, and you cannot empty any of the juice out the bottle. You need to stay just like that. Wait, I was gonna, I forgot, I was gonna say you can't just like, you, the, didn't I, didn't I say that in the beginning? You can't just like set something like, I meant, yeah, it needs to hang like this, but you can't just have something sitting on the mat. You didn't say that. I was gonna say that, but you're not. Okay, well, you know, you can't like, no, I mean, yeah, no, I meant to say that in the beginning, it just slipped, slipped my mind. I literally said, I said that the book is holding on top. That's the only reason it's staying there because the book is holding the center of mass of the bottle down. Okay. Flower powder donut prank. Jazz, you want to try one of my donuts? Sure. They are actually very delicious. Go ahead, try. No, no, no. Try one of the powder ones. There's only one left. Those are the best ones. They're super good. Okay. I just saved this specifically for you. Can I have one? Yeah, go ahead. I only have the chocolate ones, but the powder one is delicious. I'm telling you, it's like gourmet. Like Chef Ramsay made it himself, pretty much. It's super Wanna good. <laughs> yeah. Wait, no, no, no. Don't switch. I actually, wait, wait, no. I meant the 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 the, the chocolate ones are probably the best because they're like. From the Ch Charlie's Chocolate Factory, and they're they're the powder ones are like not they're not that good. It doesn't matter. I don't like the chocolate donuts. But the, the powder, they're not that. Why does it taste like that? Like what? Like it's expired. Oh, I think that the uh, the the donut shop they have the 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 the, the, the new recipe is like uh, it, um. I think they got them from ex expired dot com, but they're 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 they're, not, they're just supposed to be like that. But they're they're just the 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 texture of the the dough that they make the donut is probably like, I mean, that, that's why I said to get one of the chocolate donuts. I have two buckets. Okay. Underneath them are glass of Orbeez. Okay. If you could pick which one has the most Orbeez, I'll give you $20. If not, you lose $20. So I just got to pick the one that has the most Orbeez. Mm hmm But I just randomly pick the, one of the buckets? Mm-hmm. All right, bet. Well, that's like 50, 50 yards. You said $20? Jazzy, come here. All right. What? Mm -hmm. Did you eat my chips? What chips? The ones I saw you eating last night. Those are my chips. Your chips are my chips. No, they're not. Yes, they are. I paid for them. So you paid for them with the money that you owe me. I don't owe you money. Jazzy, come on. We don't go all day. Are you going to hurry up? We're going to argue later. So you say I just got to just pick one randomly, right? The one that has the most Orbeez? Mm-hmm. This one. Right? No, 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 this no. one. My heart is going on this one. You already, no, you, you never said that. I could. No, I'm locking in my one. answer at this one. No, you I'm locking one. in my answer at this one. Are you sure? Yes. Are you I'm positive? sure. Yes, I'm positive. Positive. Negative. Yeah, I'm positive. Okay. This one. <laughs> this one look like it got a million. This one got like what? Ten. <laughs> Eleven. 
Uno, uno in Spanish, 11. <laughs> Are you really gonna be a sore loser? You can't win bets every single time. It was just like a random guess. Like I just seen the. Just... <laughs> that one has the most orange. If you could solve this problem without erasing anything or crossing out the equal sign, I'll give you $20. But if you can't, then you have to give me $20. All right, bet. 8 plus 8 equals 91. And I, I can't cross out the equal sign, right? Nah. But I could draw like a number or something like that? Mm -hmm. Wait, can I use my glasses? Sure. All right. <laughs> so. Oh, <laughs> I got. I, 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 I see it. Do you know about the New Newton's theory? Yeah. Or PEMDAS. PEMDAS, because you know, uh, 8 is basically, that's four zero. And zero times a zero equals zero. And this is a zero two, but just two one. So basically, if I put 18 plus 8, it equals 9 to the second power plus 1 equals infinity. No. What do you mean, girl? What do you mean? What kind that of math do you do? Sense. What? What do you mean doesn't make any sense? To the second power, this is two circles. Go, what do you mean doesn't make sense? What is nine to the second power? 56? No. Girl, what? You do it then, let me see. You clearly don't know math. 16 equals eight plus eight. Girl, that don't, that don't even look like a six. That's a B. Girl, is this English or math? Okay, well, if it's a B, then this would be 16. One B divided by one divided by one. B equals 16. B doesn't exist though. B doesn't exist. It's just an expression for the formula of Newton's theory. You wanna play this game? Sure. So pick either A or B. There's two options. Either I give you 100 grand or you give me 100 grand. So you basically have like uh, 50, 40 odds or 50, 50, something like that. I'm not good at math. But go anyways, pick A or B, whatever you want. A. What do you mean A? I want A. You sure? Yeah. You're not gonna regret that. This is a hundred grand on the line. Are you positive? Yeah. You wanna you wanna stick with A? I want A. Are you positive? Yeah. Look what you could have got. That's crazy. So you, you said A, you gotta give me a hundred grand. Yeah. I tried to convince you to switch, like you didn't want to do it. <laughs> like I was literally trying to give you a hundred grand, but you were not listening. So pay up. I I could take you to the bank if you need to go to the bank, because girl, you don't have a hundred grand on you, that's a lot of money. And uh, What is this? What is this? A hundred grand. Girl, I, this, is, this is chocolate. You, you cheated. That's not even. I didn't cheat. You cheated. Whoa! Wait, how? How? Whoa! Hmm.
If you can erase everything on this piece of paper, then I'll give you $100, all right? You gotta erase everything though, all right? Go ahead. Oh my God, totally forgot you can use a freaking eraser to erase pencil. <laughs> You done? Yeah. <laughs> you know I said erase everything, right? I did. That includes the back of the paper. <laughs> April Fools. <laughs> so go ahead, get to erasing. You already included in the best, so you can't back out now. So this go ahead. is pen. How am I supposed to erase it? You're not. <laughs> <laughs> so go ahead. I don't know how. So you give up? April Fools. You know that's pen, right? What are you trying to do? Get the wrinkles out the pig? What? I did it. I wasn't even looking. I had my out. There was like ant crawling on my toe. I wasn't looking. You switched the paper. No, didn't I didn't. Yes, you I didn't even touch the paper. I wasn't even looking. You probably switched the paper. I was looking That's down. That's not my fault. No, you got to do it again. I didn't even see. I was looking down. There was a bug crawling on my big toe. Do it again. Fine. You already know you switched the paper. This is definitely not the same paper. That was pen. You can't just erase pen. What are you trying to do? Blow some air on the freaking... Where's the money? I don't got cash on me right now. I take Apple Pay. Go ahead, P. Go ahead, P. Paris, go. Come on, Paris. 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 Yo, Chuck, Chuck, it's Chuck. I told y'all it was Chuck. Dre, take your damn shoe off. It's way over there. Hey, Chuck, this way. This way. Dre, take your shoe off. Chuck. Dre, take your shoe off. Please, Chuck. Please, Chuck. Please. Dre, you don't need no. Dre, take your shoe off. Please, Chuck. Please, Chuck. Okay, okay, Please, Chuck. Okay, okay. Wait, Chuck. I got a Chuck ain't even holding this shit. Bro, I'm done. Hey, what's up? I can't breathe. Hey, take your seat. Hey, stop. Hey, stop. Oh, oh, stop. Oh, God, bro, all right, all right, all right. Hold on. Hey. Hey. My back is oh. up. Take the other one off. Hold on, hold on. All right, go. Wait, you take your other one off. All right, Jazz. Now put yours back on. Bro, something flabbergasted. No, you look at the coordination. No, 
Go. Oh, oh, my abs hurt. Oh, here. Oh, wait, that's mine. Here. <laughs> Come on, we almost got it. Oh, my. Are right, you guys be prepared for this, right? Oh, okay, look at the balance. <laughs> Where, where's the other shoe at? Where's the other shoe at? Oh, it's right here. Go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> not the struggle at the you end. Got it on? No. Not the right shoe. All right, take, take, all right, let's do it again. Take, yeah. Why is it tilting so much? Oh! 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 Go! Yeah. Hey, easy. Yeah. Easy. 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 Money. Easy. Money easy. 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 Easy.